Well, fractions are fun, the fractions are useful, and that you have to practice them to be good at them. As long as kids feel that they're fun, I think everything will kind of fall into place, and that's kind of the intent behind this game here. What I've done over the last few years teaching both math and woodshop is I've, I've really spent a lot of time going back through standardized exams and looking at the, the essential skills kids need both to do well in math classes at, at a high school level and also to do well on standardized exams and skills that they really need to get a career oriented job at a high school. And I came up with these seven skills um, and the first of these seven skills, seven math skills, is measurement. The second one is fractions. A and you'll see here that they're really all the same thing. The third one is ratio or proportion. The fourth is probability. The fifth is decimals, percents, and then the seventh is geometry. And you can see on these seven essential skills that they're really the same thing. I mean, the key in any kind of measurement is if you're looking at a ruler, uh, odometer, anything, is to figure out the total number of marks in, in your ruler, and that's going to be your denominator. So if I'm right over here, you know, six marks over, I'm at one and six eighths, or one and three quarters. Okay? So measurement is really a fraction as well. You just have to figure out what number goes on the top, you know, and then the total number of marks. So measurement, fractions are obviously a fraction. Ratio, proportion, this is a ratio or a fraction. 11 of you use jobs that require fractions out of a total of 15. You know, if I say that was a sample of 50 people and set that ratio equal to another ratio, then that's a proportion. So it's all the same thing. Probability is the likelihood of an event. And as well, that's really a fraction too. If, if I were to say, if this was a sample of the general public in Plaster County, what's the likelihood that they would um, have a job or an occupation that required fractions, you know, this would also be a probability. It would be the number of successes over the total. So you can see probability is really a fraction. Decimals are the exact same thing. You know, if I have 0.15, that's a fraction where the denominator is always a factor of 10. Um, percents are the exact same thing as a decimal just moved over. And then really one of the key learning things you need to do in geometry is really fractions as well, whether Pi, you know, is a fraction of circumference divided by diameter. Area of a triangle is base times height divided by two. So they're all fractions as well. So even though there are seven essential skills here, I really think all of them are, are really basically the same thing. But what I've noticed with kids, the only kids who are really good with the ruler and fractions are the kids who spend their whole life in a wood shop or, or working on cars. And adults as well, I mean, a lot of you are really good at fractions because you do them every day in the classroom, but the majority of people who have fractions inside and out are tradesmen who use them every day. And that's kind of the point of this game, is that first to make it fun, but to have that daily practice for a few minutes.